It's the time now. In just three years, N-Dubs have sold out two tours, picked up three MOBA awards, and they've scored a number one single along the way. Now their book is number two in the bestseller list, and they've got their sights set on America as well. So we're going to catch up with them right now. Good morning, Dappy. Good morning, Faser. And to Lisa. Good morning Hello. to you. How are you doing? Beautiful new hair. Thank you. I've What's the uh, thinking behind it? It works. Fancied a bit of a revamp. Mm. Just, that was just it. do it. Yeah, fresh start. <laughs> just good. Yeah, yeah, fresh start. All right, like, look, before Thank we you. before we talk about <clears throat> the successes, we've got to talk to you. Yeah. Because you've been a bit foolish again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to report this. I'd love to get your opinion on this. It says N-Dubs Dappy dabbling in meow, meow. Now, this is something that you've admitted, right? Yeah. Methadrone, before it was yeah. illegal. Yeah. 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 I guess that was a nightclub in Essex a yeah. few weeks yeah. ago. I just, want, I just want to say that um, I'm more than glad, um, genuinely, that they've banned, banned this thing because I've seen how many people are dying of it and whatnot and, and it's just not a thing to, to be doing and I've learnt my mistake and, and I'll never do such things again. But it's happened in the past as well. It's happened you, in the you, past. You've been stuck into this stuff it, before and the kids look up to you. Of I course. Mean, you've it, got to stop it. Of course. Do you know what it was? It was a night out and it was, it mm. was, it was, it was just a bit tipsy and, and it was just fell into a wrong place at the wrong time and I, sh I don't think I'll ever touch any silly stuff again. And well, you know, it's, it, it, you know, it's probably tough for your bandmates to kind of, you know, support you sometimes in that, but I mean, I guess this is all part of growing you up, know, right? Yeah, yeah. Like, at the end of the day, all I can say is that I don't condone drugs. I've never touched them, never will, and, you know, as much as in dubs are free, we're also defined characters, so... Isn't it tough to resist temptation, though, growing up? I mean, you guys did have a a difficult time yeah, of growing course. up. It's in your new book. It's lot, interesting. Yeah, it I lot growing up in a negative background and whatnot, and um, I just think now people are quick to try and catch us and set us up and, and do silly things to us and catch us on camera. And, and no matter how many people in this industry say, you know, they make out it's all glossy behind closed yeah. doors, it isn't. And let me tell you, there's no secret that drugs is a very serious issue in the music industry and a lot more people than you know do it. And when it's become such a normal thing behind closed doors, yeah, it's easy to get tempted and get sucked yeah. in. And well, it would be a shame to lose everything yeah, and your fans to lose you because they see you as role models. I mean, mm. now, I guess, Faze, are you looking for America now? Are you looking to, yeah, to, to kick definitely. off Yeah, most definitely. Um, we want to branch out and take end dubs across the world. It's not about limiting ourselves and staying inside a box. So things like this, um, yeah, it's a big dent. But um, you know what? Do you know we what we is, move is, on. We move on to the uh, next one our and fans, we conquer things yeah. and keep it moving our to the next day. Really, our fans are with us everywhere, everywhere we go. And I mean, it's just it's it's something where where it's it's, it's never then it should never be done again. I, I don't think no one should be taking those type of those yeah, those things. I mean, if you know, you have to try things to to understand that they're bad. And I'm telling not you, always, not always. Sometimes that's I know what you mean. And it's like I've learnt my mistake, okay. and I felt unwell that day, and mm -hmm. I, I don't feel I'll ever touch any type of. You've got a reality show, right? Cool. Is there some? Rea this is going to be, you know, a monster of a show if it goes it ahead. Is this, yeah. is you know, this it's, it's going to be full reality. It's going to be. Of, it's just going to show exactly how people um, from um, being broke and then slowly, slowly becoming financially unstable, and mm. then it, financially stable. Yeah, yeah, and it's just going to show. It's um, good. Yeah, of how we are as people. Just Looking a daily thing, every aspect of our life. Little things, you might follow me going shopping, you might follow us mm. to a show, just... Yeah, yeah I would stuff. like to see that. The moment you made <laughs> the decision funny. to change. It was, yeah. it, was, it was lovely. When will you, when will you change back? Um, <laughs> you look, it's, it's always good to see you in here, and thank you for being so frank uh, course, with us about all that. The best of luck with the book, and I know you're uh, off in the summer and everything else. Take yeah. care of yourself, we can't reach each other. I hope, yes, I I hope you buy our new album. It may not be for me, but I'll certainly help the kids. Help the third one go platinum as well. All right, that's it. Thank you very much.